Good afternoon, everyone. I hope you all had a lovely weekend. I know um, Monday is not our favourite day of the week, but hopefully I can bring you a little joy by watching me play rubbish at Football Manager and uh, at least cheer you up a bit. But um, yeah, hope you're all all right. Now, where you left us off last, um, before I tell you about my tactical change, we did not have the best of bumps in December. So uh, we didn't win a game at all. We actually, the last game we won was in no, on November the, the 4th. We've had six games where we've drawn three and lost three, which is not ideal. Um, so I've decided to change tactics again for like the fourth time. And, and this is not a, this is a, a, a standard, box standard um, 424 gag and press. Now, the reason why I've gone gag and press is because even though it's not, even though it's not cheating by download, using the downloadable tactic, it is overpowered on match, match ending. So I'm hoping it will work out well for us. Um, I'm not changing any of the roles. I've just left them as the standard roles they've done and the instructions. So I'm just hoping, really, for this to, to pull off because we really do need to start getting a few wins. We are currently, currently just like neck and neck with Airdrie. Um, at the, near the bottom of the table so we really do need to start picking up some points we should be in the playoffs we shouldn't be here so there's something terrible terribly wrong i'm just not very good i basically come to terms with the reason why i used to do well was because i was using downloaded uh cheat tactics basically not like completely overpowered ones like the nap ones or anything like that but yeah so um and also as well i, I do like managing in lower leagues but most of my saves on football manager have been um fairly good footballing teams even the, the championship teams for instance so this is testing my abilities which are, which is what i wanted i want a challenge um so this is hopefully we can turn things around yeah here's the lineup wickham is starting as well uh, hopefully this will work out well because I, I think our job's on the line. I can't remember the last episode, but I think I've got to start pulling out results. Our job. And I don't want this save to end. What, I, what I'll do is if I get sacked, I'm just going to retire the manager and uh, add a new manager as the Rake Rovers manager. So that's what I decided. Until I've completed my mission, win the Scottish Prem. That's what I'll have to do. Not that that's ideal because you don't. Nobody wants to do that because it's embarrassing. But there we go, one nil. So I did this gag and press tactic um, on my journeyman save, and um, worked out. It worked out. Ugh, I can't get the words out. It worked out well. So I'm hoping it'll do the same on here. I apologise for that noise. There's a helicopter hovering outside. Hopefully not looking for me. I've done nothing wrong, so... Right, Wickham driving it forward. Passes it to Byron. Reed. Lovely little pass to Easton. Easton. Dootsy scores. Get in. Say this get this gig and press. If in doubt, use gig and press. There you go. They were climbing up the league already. Right, we've got the ball again. Hamilton. Shooty scores. 3 0. I feel like, in a way, football the makers of football managers really should stop making this gag and press so tempting to use because. Oh, sorry about that. Technical there, error there. Um, they really got to stop. Making it so overpowered on the match engine if they can. I thought they said I thought they um, fixed it, but they haven't. Oh, there we go. But yeah, it kind of ruins it a bit, doesn't it, when you're using it and you have to use these tactics. But for now, for the rest of the season, I'm going to use Gag and Press just so I don't get much attack. And then after that, I can go back to. Find out other tactics to see if they will work.
I mean, I think people like Lelujo does the same, where he goes back to his 4-2 or 4 two diamond, whatever it's called, that he does. So, um, certain tried and tested tactics that we use to get ourselves out of the SHIT. Oh, there we go. Lucky. Got the ball now. Vaughn. Vaughn, sorry. I keep calling him Vaughn, but it's Vaughn. I don't know why I do that. Nice. A goal kick. Reed. Takes his sweet time. Passes it back to O'Reilly. I think we're doing a bit of time wasting here by the looks of it. Uh, Arbroath have been unlucky not to score, to be honest. They've had, they were very good. They've had six shots on target and a, a decent uh, XG. And in contrast, we're very lucky to have scored three goals because we've got um, we only had four shots on target, but we've had 1.1 VXG. So that means we, technically we should have only scored one goal. Well, I'm not complaining. In my Twitch stream that I did yesterday, I used the Gegen Press for the first time for uh, uh, the team that I was managing, Lebeke, and I was winning 3 0 at half time, and then all of a sudden they scored three, and it was 3 3. So I'm not getting too excited because I feel like history's going to repeat itself in this game here. I'm just hoping that they run out of time to do that. Uh, yeah, so we'll see. So I got sacked from Lebeke. And then I applied for a few jobs and I got offered a Croatian fourth division job. So I've put that. Um, the Gagan Press is working very well with that team and I'm doing quite well. Um, I finished the season with them. The only thing they wanted me to do was avoid relegation, which I did. End up getting like a mid table position. So hopefully next season we'll. Oh, there we go. Next season we'll, uh, we'll do a little bit better and. Uh, Start building a decent team with them, and then maybe I'll get headhunted at some point. Uh, kind of limited, really. There we go. I'll do. Right, let's uh, let's get this game ended now. I don't want to risk. Losing points when we've done so well to get a foot. Oh no. Oh, I just ain't meant to be. You <laughs> just can't run. You just can't. You just. Oh, Jesus Christ. Well, hopefully, the positives from this is we scored more goals with this tactic. Hopefully we can. Uh, I just I just can't believe that's happened again. Unbelievable, Jeff. Just like it's just FM. They just don't want you to win certain games, do they? No matter what you do, they're just like you're not winning. I literally could replay that game, and the same result would probably happen. Right, not long until the transfer window opens, so hopefully we can bring in some... We've already got some lined up, but hopefully we can bring in some other decent players. He... Too much money, uh, too much wage. Deli Ali, can we sign you? No, you don't want to come to us. Don't blame me, Deli Ali. Uh, can we improve new contracts? Hopefully we get a new contract so I can relax a bit. Um, have a look at the club vision. So they want us to reach the playoffs. And we technically still reach the playoffs. Um, 18, 31, no, I highly doubt it. So we might even get sacked at this point. Simply because we haven't got into the championship playoffs. Oh, 
we'll see. Hopefully we can hopefully we can turn this around. And the new tactic will hopefully work. I mean it happened. Um I drew three three in my first game with Lebecki. Then I won the next game with the the gag and press. So hopefully I can do that with uh Rafe Rovers. At the moment I feel like we're doing way better than we are. I mean, I even tried out my uh, tactic I used with Everton that was very successful, and that didn't work either. So I'm kind of stumped, really. Not using. I'm not going to use downloaded tactics. Uh, for people who don't know, because if you haven't watched all the episodes, um, basically when I start this Rafe Rover save, I completely forgot I've got this editor file that gives the Scottish teams more money in TV money basically that's why Ray Rovers have 10 million in the bank at the moment uh, we've got some new signings so hopefully they will help I'll go through them in a second right so we've got this gentleman here Baldy Southam Hales Welsh bloke signed him from Port County for eight uh, for nineteen point two five k. Got Callum Camps as well, Northern Ireland, uh, Northern Ireland midfielder, signed him for from Stockport at seventy seven k. Signed this gentleman here, uh, Mutaru Balde. Signed him from this club in Senegal on a free transfer. Looks like a decent bit of business there. Uh, all down here. Andy Halliday, the experienced arts player, playing a few, quite a few positions, mostly as a defensive midfielder. I think he'll do really well with us while he's here. Uh, we've also signed this experienced midfielder, Gonzalo Fretes, but get bring some South American flair to the team. Very good at heading, uh, good jumping reach. Signed in for a, on a free transfer from a Uruguayan team called Defensive Sporting. And we signed Ben Williams from, from Cheltenham for 42k. He is a attacking fullback. So yeah, um, hopefully a lot of them players will start in the next game. Right. Watson, he's not happy with that. Watson quite old. Oh, wrong. Oh, let's click on this one. Oh, that's why. Before we'll let you off next time. I'm doing this a little bit slower so it gives you time to read it because I'll just click on it and not think about it. Some people like to read it, don't they? Hamilton's not happy. Um. Leave them, try and extend his loan. Don't have it. We buy him. Uh, do that. Right. So we got we got Dunfermline next, and they're third. It's gonna be a tough game because we're playing at their ground as well. Hopefully, we can win. We don't win. I don't know what to do. Oh, that's the last thing we needed. Our star player injured for three to five weeks. At least Hamilton might get some game time now, though. So you always got to take the positives, don't you? Because we've got money. So we'll see what the di the director of football will bring to us. Oh great, so he's gone by. Right. How much do you want for him? Do that. Do that. Okay, so you want eighty K, that's fine. I'm off I'm all right. There we go. Do 
very good um, left back. So definitely need him in the team, and now he's not playing this game. Right, uh, this is our lineup. Let's see if we've got how many new signs are in. The Balde, Halliday, Retes, Retes, sorry. Uh, that's it. So a few new signings starting today. Hopefully that will give us uh, a bit of new a new lease of life. Right. They've scored already. That is not. That's that's just. Ah. You can't get your hopes up when the, uh, I mean, the fact that Lelujo struggled on his, his high save, I know he's kind of turned it around a little bit, but I mean, the fact that he was purposely trying to get sacked because he just couldn't be bothered with the trying to turn things around. He'd rather just I think the Scottish League, Scottish lower leagues, very difficult to do well in. Probably one of the most difficult leagues in the world when you think about it in the grand scheme of system. I mean, I've got the money, basically, but I'm not. I'm purposely not signing great players because, um, real life they wouldn't be doing that, would they? So, because they don't have the money, and I can't be bothered to start the same again because it'll just ruin the series. Because I've already recorded the videos and posted them, so yeah. Um, I could technically actually start the series again, couldn't I? And just call it. Rafe Rovers, realistic or something like that, and I'll just get rid of the added money, make it even harder than it already is. I mean, I've got money, and look at what I'm doing. I'm not doing well. Right, Dabrowski, Riley. We get a goal now. I think we're just not creating enough, are we? Look at that! Look at that! Seven shots, four on target. They've scored. We've had two shots and none on target. Just tells you everything you need to know. XG's not that much different. So, oh no, it is. Well, Dabrowski's literally keeping us in the game. Again, another great performance by him. Right, they've got a corner. Can we get out of this? End of highlight. Good. All day's not playing particularly well, which is not nice to see when he's one of our new signers. Same as Fritas. Maybe it's a language thing. They're not. Probably can't understand the Scottish. Oh, sorry about that. Probably can't understand the Scottish language. It's understandable. I mean, I'm half Scottish, and my nan and granddad had a very. I mean, they they were on the Scottish borders, but they had a very broad Scottish, uh, Scottish accent, and sometimes it was difficult to understand. All right, I'm going to give him. Uh, Brayton, hopefully that tough love will help with him. Oh, he's coming off in a minute. Uh, this is not looking good, this game. Is it? I think we're really struggling to get something out of this game. If anything, I can just see us score at them scoring again at this rate. Right. right. Who are we taking off? Who are we take? Who, who are we putting on for you? Mullen, Mullen can come on. Mullen, you're coming off. Uh, Connor Wick can come on for you. All right, we'll see if that changes anything. A corner, you never know. We could sneak a draw out of this. I'll be happy with that. Especially if they've been way the way better team. Nah. Didn't, didn't come to anything. If anything, this will probably end up turning into a goal to them, for them. No, we've still got the ball, surprisingly. Right, Just keep the ball, at least keep the ball. At least have a chance, even if it doesn't go in. Oh, I don't want to lose the ball. Stop losing the ball. Oh, nice bit of passing here. Mullen drives it forward. Yes. Get in, Connor Wickham. Gets his first goal for us. Very important goal for us as well. Right, we need to take off. Fine. Camps is making his debut for us. Uh, 
Right, can we just keep hold of this draw now? Um, good result. I'll take that. Right, then we'll be back in a minute for the next part of the episode. Thank you. Right, and we're back. And uh, we are now playing part um, Airdrie. Um, so this is our lineup. Browski, Bolde, Bolde better play better this game than he did last game. It was a terrible last game. Basically, the defense is the same as the last game. The field is the same as the last game. Wingers are the same. I think Barker didn't play actually. So Barker's in. Um, Easton's contract's expiring, so we've had part of Crystal make an offer. We are able to offer him a new contract, so we. Sorry, just switch to me. Welcome. We have offered him a new contract, and we've got Gullen and Wickham up front. So let's just see how we get on. Right, we've got the first highlight. Hopefully that's a good sign. Oh, it is a very good sign. Penalty to us already. Wickham lines up. Can you get a second goal of the season? He does. Look at that. It's his arms out in celebration as well. He's happy. That was a... I don't know what that dance move was, but yeah. 1-0. What we want. That's what we want. 10 points. Away from the playoffs. We can get a good run on us. Get a few wins in a row. I mean, I'm saying that. I mean, we've got to get one win at least to start off with. We can't seem to get a win at all at this rate. Um, even when we were 3-0 up, I still thought we were going to... But yeah, anyway, right. 2-0 up. Wickham. I had a brain fart there. Sorry. I couldn't think what I was trying to say. But yeah, we need to get this win first. And then we'll think about... Getting on a decent run after that. Like I said, we were 3-0 up the, uh, two, de two games ago. And we ended up drawing. So I'm not... Unless we're winning like 5-0, I'm not going to get overly excited thinking we're going to win. Yeah, you can take shots like that all day long. I don't mind. Nice to see Wickham getting a few goals. Gives us that other option when, when uh, Vaughan's injured. We could do with um, like three or four good, decent strikers because Cullen doesn't seem to know how to score. I mean, he's got zero. He's got, I mean, he got two goals in the Premier Sports Cup, but other than that, I mean, he's had zero goals in every game he's played for us. In fact, I'm going to sell him. I don't think it's uh, very good. Hopefully, if we get rid of him, get rid of his wages, um, we can bring in a better player. Right. Halliday is knackered. Put on Liam Dick. Freitas is knackered as well. We'll put on Camps. Yeah, we'll leave it as that for now. Let me know in the comments section what you did for your weekend. Did you do anything exciting? I didn't do anything. I I had a relaxing weekend with my girlfriend. Um, we we were we had a quite a busy weekend last weekend, so we just want to relax today. Oh, look at that! That's typical. As you score your first goal as soon as I transfer this year. Um, but yeah, let me know in the comment section. Eastern. Okay, we're three 0 up. But like I said, we were three 0 up last time and uh we didn't win uh if we get another one might get a little bit more excited a bit more happy we also want this clock to run quite quickly now we can relax our first win since the 4th of november which is ridiculous in hindsight when you think about it This is where they score now. Yep. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. History's repeating itself.
History's repeating itself. See what they'll win this game now. I've just got a feeling. I mean, what more can I mean? My defense must be really shit. Sorry for swearing, but really rubbish. I apologize. If uh, I if I score, I mean, it's just <laughs> you gotta laugh, ain't you? Because if you don't, you're just gonna cry at this point. <sighs> and they've still got time to score the winner. I mean, what what more can I do? Like literally three goals, and it's happened again. Yeah, at least it was fun for the neutrals, not fun for me. Fans ain't going to be happy with me at this point. Right, at this point, I'm going to end that episode on there. Hopefully, next episode we do a little better. Yeah, thanks everyone for following so far. Um, I appreciate support. Hopefully, next episode it will be a little bit better, or it could be the end. We'll soon find out. Tune in to find out tomorrow. Uh, all the best.